27 forecast. Well, it was a pretty soggy start to the weekend. This is what it looked like outside for most parts of the valley into the early afternoon and evening. Very gray and soggy out there. Temperatures a little bit cooler, sitting at 69 degrees, but the humidity is out there in full force. It's pretty sticky out there. Let's go ahead and take a look at radar. Some parts of the valley saw rain as early as 9, 10 o'clock, and it's just been sticking with it through the afternoon and into the evening. Here's a three hour radar loop, and what's interesting about the pattern of rain is it's really stuck to one pretty uh, straight line, leaving parts of uh, Trumbull County dry for most of the day, but some areas is seeing very persistent rain through the first part of the day into the evening. So here's a look at our 12 hour rainfall. Uh, and again, you can see just this line of where the rain has been consistently moving through the afternoon and evening. Um, I, I queried uh, the accumulation in one spot in Trumbull County, and it's picking up on eight tenths of an inch uh, in Columbiana County. So some areas saw a lot less this afternoon, closer to a quarter of an inch, some areas closer to an inch. But again, just more soggy weather. Uh, for us this Saturday. Here's a current look at radar. Again, still picking up on uh, quite a bit of rain moving through parts of the valley. Just slow, persistent, uh, kind of a soggy day out there. Uh, picking up on heavier rain into Columbiana County. Not seeing any thunder uh, really at all this afternoon for the viewing area, uh, but again, continuing to monitor these showers and storms as they move through. So this is all brought to us by what's left of Tropical Storm Bill. He has now transitioned into what's called a post-tropical cyclone, uh, and you can see a very well-defined circulation as it moves out of Ohio through West Virginia. And again, that brought us that very persistent rain all through the morning and into the evening. So let's take a look at uh, our future tracker. This is our high-resolution model, which will bring us, you know, the the latest updates. As we head through the next hours, we will see some of those showers stick around, but they will begin to taper off as we head into the overnight. Temperatures eventually falling to the mid 60s, but again, we're going to keep that humidity through the evening and into the overnight. Tomorrow, more wet weather to talk about. Here's the Storm Prediction Center's outlook for tomorrow. So part of the valley falls under the slight category. The other part falls under the marginal. Uh, so what that means is we do have, we could potentially have the right ingredients to see some stronger to severe storms tomorrow. Right now, uh, the primary concern being some stronger winds and possibly some hail. So let's break this down hour by hour for you. I'll be in tomorrow afternoon keeping an eye on these storms as you head through your Sunday. So tomorrow morning to start the day, temperatures in the mid uh, 60s, upper seven, lower 70s. As we go through the afternoon, we're going to hang on to those clouds and we'll see the chance for showers and storms increase starting as early as 10 o'clock. We could see some wet weather. As we go through the afternoon, the instability starts to, to mix up. That's when we could see some of these stronger storms uh, into the afternoon and evening on your Sunday. So uh, although it's Father's Day, it may be a good movie day to hang out with dad being hot, humid, and that chance of wet weather. The good news, all of this out of the way by Monday. We'll go through the day on Monday. We'll lose those clouds, and I'm thinking we'll see some sunshine to kick off the work week and dry weather expected. That's something we have not seen in a while. So for tonight, we're going to hang on to some of those showers. Temperatures eventually falling to the mid-60s. Again, tomorrow, another warm and humid day. Temperatures in the mid-80s. Uh, again, a chance for some stronger showers and thunderstorms into the afternoon. So just be weather aware as you're headed out on your Sunday. Um, by Monday, again, looking forward to that sunshine. We'll keep the warm temperatures, a high of 82 degrees, 